Uh, I'm Ye Lu uh, in Chinese. Uh, Ye is my family name. And uh, I'm the editorial director for physical sciences and engineering in China. I have a team of uh, 15 people and uh, um, 12 of them in, in, in Beijing office and uh, two in Shanghai. I um, studied uh, mechanics in Peking University and got a BS degree. And then I uh, got uh, a Master of Business Administration degree from Tongji University. And uh, finally, I got a PhD degree from uh, Shanghai Jiao Tong University in the history of science. Before I joined Springer, I worked in a, a Chinese publisher in Shanghai for almost 20 years. And uh, in 2006, I joined Springer, so almost 10 years now. Actually, Springer set up its uh, first uh, uh, representative office in China in 2006. Springer uh, has a long-term uh, uh, relationship with Chinese uh, scientific community and uh, government even uh, much longer before 2006. The first uh, um, event Springer joined in China was back into like 1978. And uh, after that, in 1980s and in 1990s, uh, Springer strengthened its uh, relationship with the uh, uh, Chinese scientific community and the Chinese uh, government by support uh, China in developing its uh, scientific uh, research program. Uh, during that uh, period of time, Springer already established uh, a good relationship with, uh, with Chinese partners, also with Chinese publishers. So I, I was working in the Shanghai uh, Scientific Publishing House, and at that time, we already have some good uh, co-publishing projects uh, with Springer. Uh, we uh, established and uh, developed a very good uh, uh, partnership relationship with uh, the Chinese Academy of Sciences. Uh, in 2006 and 2007, uh, we signed uh, more than 30 uh, journals with CAS, uh, covering various um, uh, subject areas. Uh, but mainly, in we call it hard science, uh, this uh, uh, chemistry, physics, Earth sciences. We also um, worked closely with the publishing branch of CAS, uh, publishing some uh, um, uh, books uh, uh, authored by Chinese scientists. Uh, one of these uh, books we published together with Science Press uh, was the uh, uh, Chinese uh, Roadmap uh, 2050. The editor in chief of this book series is Professor Lu Yongxiang the then uh, president of Chinese Academy of Sciences. Springer, um, as a publisher, uh, we serve the scientific community and we want to provide our publishing service uh, to the scientists as close as possible. So that's why Springer have this editorial team on the ground. And we are expanding the editors here in China in a very fast pace. Uh, why we do that? because we want to provide our publishing service to our Chinese authors in a very close and a very, uh, for them, very convenient way. Our editors can talk to them in, in Chinese and can, can uh, answer their questions anytime they want, can, can talk to them in person. So all these can uh, greatly improve our um, service to the local Chinese uh, communities. And the Springer do that uh, is not uh, a one way. We want to uh, publish the best content uh, from China. Uh, we want to uh, provide best service to the Chinese scientific community. But at the same time, we also want to provide our best content and product to the Chinese research community and uh, let them to be um, uh, um, have a better exchange uh, with the global uh, scientific community. After the merger between Springer and Macmillan, and uh, now we, you know, we call uh, our company called uh, Springer Nature. We now have uh, two offices, one in Beijing and one in Shanghai, and we have more than 80 uh, editorial staff now 
in China. So that means we have uh, uh, more capacity to provide a, a, a better service to the uh, Chinese uh, uh, scientific community. Material science is uh, a highly interdisciplinary science, uh, but mainly it based on like traditional research like chemistry and physics. In China, actually, uh, chemistry and material science is the developing so fast. They are now uh, ranking very highly uh, in, in, in the world in, in this, um, in, in like material science and chemistry. So um, we have uh, also some very good uh, projects uh, like journals and books in this area, like nano research uh, and also like uh, rare metals. Uh, these are also quite good journals in the niche area of material science. And also we just signed a book with the vice, vice president of Tsinghua University, uh, Professor Yu Zheng. He is also a, a member of Chinese Academy of Sciences. Uh, we will publish a five, five volume uh, MRW uh, in, in the area of biomaterials. So the, all this um, um, effort uh, um, uh, will give us a very uh, a good uh, uh, publication portfolio uh, from China to contribute to our global like e-book package or e-journal package, uh, journal packages in terms of material science.